Yay! Ah. Kenny and Sarita have been staying with us for several weeks. Sarita? It used to be a ski lodge, obviously, so we have plenty of food. And uh, believe it or not, we still get some power from that wind turbine out front. We tend to keep most of the lights off at night to avoid drawing attention. That's probably a good but idea. After we found this stuff in storage. We couldn't resist making an exception. What's funny? Oh, nothing, Walt. Walter here's one smart son of a bitch. Makes a mean can of beans, too. <laughs> Why don't you two catch up while I get some dinner started? Please hey, make everybody. yourselves at home. You can leave your things over there. The hell we will. Yeah, I'm holding on to my rifle. Thanks. No, you're not. You're our guests here. There's no need to worry. Tell him to put his gun down, then. Kenny? Do you vouch for these people, Clem? I do. If you tell me they're good, then I'm good. us. You were the one waving a gun around, man. They're cool. <clears throat> Dad, look! A Christmas tree! Well, no, Sarah. Ah. Isn't it great? We found it all in storage. It's amazing. Ah. Now you put yours down. Good. If you'll all follow me, I'll show you where you can sleep. I hope this doesn't bite me in the ass. I really do. <coughs> so is Sarita and Kenny a thing? Or rather, are they a thing? Are they... Wow, I don't even know what to think. Like, it's nice that he moved on. Or hopefully. Aww. We get to talk about Still Lee. wearing this dirty old thing, huh? Oh, fuck off. It's mine. Oh, well, I half expected to see Lee walk up next to you. You guys were like two peas in a pod. Yeah, he's gone. Oh, shit, I didn't mean to... It's just hard not to think about it, you know? Yeah. I know, you're from Florida. He saved me. I knew it. I knew he would. That guy had a fire in him, sure as shit. Yeah, he did. Hell. But he was, he was bit. a hell of a guy. When my son, well, he helped me do the right thing. I'll never forget that. Aww. See, I feel really good for that. So, where'd you end up? That was with Krista was with and Omid. Krista and Omid. Omid. Well, Krista and I were together for a while. These guys caught us. She's gone. Yeah, I was kind of hoping to be able to find her, though. Sounds like it ain't been easy for you. I'm sorry, darling. I wish I could have found you sooner. Where have you been? Oh, hell. All over after Savannah. Good. How did you get out of here? Yeah, how did you? For some reason, I tried to save that fucking shit bird van. Then it turned into a damn cluster. Couldn't help the kid, but I got out. Long story short, I got lucky. Real lucky. Ooh. Spent a long time alone after that. It, uh... Yeah. Bad place. And then I met Sarita. Thank God. Gosh, it's great to have you back. You two catching up? Yeah, we well, are. This is my girl, Sarita. Yeah. She's beautiful. He moved on. Nice That's good. Valentine. Hey, Walt, where's Matthew? He's still <coughs> out there rooting around? Of course he is. Well, I'll start dinner. Carlos, right? Mind if I steal your daughter for a secret mission? Please. Stay in sight, sweetie. Ugh. Can we do anything to help? Could use a hand outside. We got a lot of supplies to bring in before that storm hits. Yeah, we do. Sure. Clay, Can I help? Why don't you help Walt with dinner? Ugh. Oh. I'm on dinner duty. Great. <sighs> hey, Clementine. 
settling in well enough? Yeah. yeah. Thanks. Excellent. Want to help me prepare a little dinner? So how do you know Kenny? He and Sarita have been a huge help. We're old friends. I met him after it happened. Yeah. When he was with Lee? Yeah, he only told us a little. Okay, so I won't talk about it then. Connecting with people is so important. Yeah, it is. I don't know what I'd do without Matthew. Uh-oh. I sense foreshadowing. Gosh, you remind me of my students. <coughs> I can't imagine what it's like growing up in the middle of all this. It hasn't been easy. It hasn't been easy. I can imagine. It's hard enough as an adult. Yeah. Hmm. Almost done. Would you do me the honor of tasting the first course, madam? Sure. Uh, looks great. It looks great. It looks like mush. <laughs> no, it doesn't. <laughs> mm -mm -mm. As an artist, there's nothing I like less than a friendly critic. Huh. Striking resemblance. Uh. Gee, thanks. Anyway, I'll take it from here. Mm -hmm. you turn off that bib, please? Okay, sure. I'll just look around the lodge. Oh, the little glare she just threw at it. Okay, so I can't go that way. That's fine. I'm gonna pick up a CD. Oh no, I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna play the CD. Cousin Jared's concert, October thirteenth, nineteen ninety-eight. Nah, I'm just gonna look at it. I'm not actually gonna play it because that would be stupid. Crazy. Let's take a look nice at the dinner table. <laughs> yeah, it does. You know, I've personally never been to a ski lodge myself, so... Yeah. Ah, uh, let's look at the decoration before we start talking to people. Ah, uh, it's a duck! Let's take a look at the map. <laughs> wow. Clem, we could use some help. <coughs> Here, Sarah, you take this and string them up over there. Okay. And what am I doing? You knew Kenny before. It must be incredible to see him again. Yeah. When I met him, well, he's so different now. Yeah, how so did you meet? How did you meet Kenny? I found him holed up in an old restaurant, if you can believe it. I can. Hold up. You should have seen his beard then. What? Perfect. Now we just need the topper. We always had an angel on top of our tree. Aww. My family didn't celebrate Christmas, but I still love the decorations. Ah, okay. Yeah. Oh, wait a minute. What about the duck? Can the duck be a... No, it's not. Never mind. <clears throat> Fine. I thought that would be a pretty good one. Let's look at the fireplace. I still gotta find that Christmas tree topper thing and explore the lodge. Oh, that must feel so nice after walking around in God knows what temperatures. Okay, I can't go any further than that. I guess upstairs maybe? Hi. It's been a week, man. We're <coughs> gonna be out of the woods. We can't be sure. 
They might be tracking us. Tracking? Who? What do you think they are? Ninjas? They could very well be. Clem, Luke said you saw some people in the valley. Yeah, I did. People? Way down Well, I saw lights, rather. I saw lights. Which way did they go? Back to the woods. We cannot take any chances. We leave at dawn. Aww. We're safe here for tonight, right? Clementine, you talked to that man Walter, right? What did he say? You didn't tell him anything about us, did you? No, we, we just talked about Kenny. Careful. We mostly talked about Kenny. Kenny is the loud man with the beard. Oh, yeah, gee, thanks. That's him. Don't be I mean. Don't what that <coughs> We're staying here tonight. Ha! <laughs> just talk to the rest of them. They trust you. See what you can find out. I'm gonna go find Luke. Honey, I don't feel so good. Oh God. Hey, what's wrong? I just need something to drink. You got it. I'll be right back. Was that her excuse to get rid of him? I wonder. Let's examine the box for a sec. Ooh. Uh, I always had a star on mine, but Sarah mentioned an angel, so let's be nostalgic. Actually, you know what? We're going to back out for now. Because I want to talk to Rebecca as well. Uh, it won't let me. Fine. <clears throat> oh, derp, because I'm right here. Okay. There you go. She looks so cool. Beautiful. Uh, I used to love this time of year. You know, now that your friends are here, this place is starting to feel like a real home. Ah. Matthew and Walter are amazing people. Oh, balls. Honestly, it's dangerous to be this kind, but they can't help it. Wait until you meet Matthew. He's a real character. Where is, Where Matthew? is Matthew? Oh, he likes to go on long walks. He and Walter used to vacation here. He should be back soon. Okay. Clem, I wanted to ask you, does Kenny seem different to you? I didn't know him before, and, well, I'm curious. Oh, uh, balls. Bad days, I guess. <coughs> uh, but I get the feeling he's oh, sad. shit. He's no. The same old Kenny to me. Oh, well, that's good. I well, shouldn't have said that. Busy? Kenny, isn't it great? I got it out. I think I can manage, Ken. I said I got it. Oh. Always has to play the gentleman. But I'll tell you, when I met him, he couldn't lift a fly. Hmm. Why don't you go see if your friends are ready for dinner, Clementine? Okay. So yeah, he he definitely does seem a little on edge. I wonder if it's because of my presence. Okay, uh, Rebecca. Let's talk to you. Are you okay? <coughs> Just got a little dizzy. I can't even take care of myself. How am I supposed to raise a child? I mean, how can anyone now? It's, it's not, not gonna, gonna be, be easy. easy. That's really all I can say. I know it's gonna be hard. But at the same time, I already feel a little less lonely. Aww. Because I know that no matter what happens, I'll get to meet someone new. Aww. She's kicking. You wanna listen? Course. Good, huh? Can I? She's gonna be a runner. <laughs> Hopefully. Oh, what's wrong? It's not his. Uh. How do you know? How do you know? I just do. We were trying for so long, and, and then. Alvin finds out he'll kill me. I don't know what to do. Oh, shit. I can't asking a little girl for advice. He won't kill he you. He won't kill you. There's my man. You all right, baby? I'm fine, you big dope. Just need to get some food in you. Thanks for staying with her, Clem. Oh, no problem. Well, everyone, dinner is <coughs> served. Come on, let's eat. I don't think I got to talk to as many people.
I don't know who I'm gonna sit with. You okay, man? Yeah. Just. I wish I hadn't pulled that trigger. Just try to forget about it. Right here, Clem. Oh shit. Oh shit. They're gonna make me choose. <laughs> oh balls. I kind of want to sit next to Luke, but I kind of want to sit next to Kenny too. Balls. <laughs> oh, God damn it.